All right, welcome to another man's point of view. Today, I got for you a taboo subject. Now, this is the be all end all <laughs> of taboos. Um, because there's a universal truth to it, but nobody wants to talk about it. But I'm gonna give you some insight. Um, <laughs> of this taboo to show you um, just how hard it is but and to show you the two sides right like I always say once you put your uh, the man's point of view and you see the truth for what it really is it all makes sense right so um, let's go ahead and begin body count does body count matter should men care about body count how to bring this up in a conversation or if you should even bring it up at all we're going to cover everything body count related today so let's get into it number one do you think that um i will say this notice the question is this right does body count count or should it count for men however the women are the ones telling you if it does or it doesn't and right there, right off the bat, man's point of view, irrelevant what they say. However, the insight is very telling. Check it out. And um, so with the man's point of view, you will see um, the little fine details of what I'm talking about, right? So let me cut this sorry ass soundtrack off. All right. So I can get you into the details, right? And notice... Why I always say that they are two, right? They will always give you hidden answers, right? Check it out. Body count matters. Um, I think it matters to some people, and if it matters to you, then that's fine. Um, you just have to find somebody that agrees with you, and don't try to change their mind. That. There you go. Three answers. Right. No coincidence there. Right. So she said it matters to some people. Right. And uh, but if it matters to you, that's fine. And then she gives you the final answer, which is the truth. Um, don't try to change anybody. Here's the problem with that. Right. A very um, telling answer from a woman. Uh, put your little man's point of view goggles and you realize that it's irrelevant because there's nothing you can do right don't matter what you think body count is body count that's it there ain't no coming back and they know this but they can never tell you this because it, that's like showing you her hand now why the hell would she do that of course she's going to give you three sorry ass answers to confuse you and again it's irrelevant right because we all know the truth now before i continue I'm going to give you a quote, which will go come back at the end of this, right? Beware of those who claim to have no interest in power, for this is often a strategy to disarm you. When the time comes, they will strike without hesitation, and it will be too late to act, right? <laughs> Perfect quote for this one, right? Um, cause it tells you everything you need to know and everything I just said, right, about there's nothing you can do. However, it's a problem of whoever is playing the it doesn't matter thing, right? And without hesitation, they will attack. You go either way. But anyway, let's continue. That is such a hard question for me because my gut says yes, but There you go. My gut said that's all you need to know. But notice, once again, it's a universal truth, right? My gut's a bit, but here's the disclaimer. Being a real woman in today's world, somebody's past shouldn't affect how you look at them moving forward. There you go. What you really meant is being a woman in 2022, right? And also realize she threw in the being a real woman, right? Let me break that down real quick. All these people that claim to be a woman twenty today, 2022, if you ain't, you ain't. So stop. No, no, you can do whatever the hell you want. I don't care. 
but you ain't. Right? A woman is a woman. That's it. If you're confused with that, well, <laughs> clearly, um, this ain't the video for you. <laughs> right? I mean, it's the most basic and simplest thing. And now there's this big way. Well, anyway, I was going to go on a rant. Let's continue. Um, so I'm, I'm honestly kind of torn on that one. I, I would have to say, I would have to say, yeah, it personally, it does matter for me. I think yep. it matters to some extent because it shows like if your body count is like too high. Ain't no such thing as too high. Body count is body count. Once again, that's what you must untrain. There ain't no acceptable number. Which is the point, right? Once again, right? Like at that point, like what, what, what number is an acceptable number, right? It just ain't. Sadly, at least for the man. Um, and anybody that says again, go back to my quote, <laughs> right? They're full of shit. Let's continue. Then I would just think that you're just going after me because I'm just like one of the other like millions of girls that you've gone after. So yeah, I definitely think it matters to some extent. Of course. No. <laughs> the, oh, you saw that? Now that's telling too, right? She's like, no. She had a bitch ass attitude, which means her count is probably high. That's why she reacts like that. Right, because remember, again, it all comes down to respect, like I've been saying all along. That's why you see that little attitude. Nope, because she's hell-bent right, to make you believe something that's not true and something that everybody knows is true, right? So anyways, let's continue. What was I going to say about the other one? Uh, well, let's continue. No, to an extent. I mean... I'm not going to judge someone for what they did in college, high school, early 20s. Spoiler alert. <laughs> you judging someone? Irrelevant. We're talking about you, honey. <laughs> Remember, that's why we say they're always going to give you two. Because they count for two. And act for two. And, you know, well, anyways. There you go, right? Another perfect example of how she's thinking, she's talking in third person, like, well, I'm not going to judge anybody, because she's, here's another thing that you must untrain as a man, untrain this, that we are in the same boat, we're not, we're talking specifically about twos, meaning women, that's it, when they give you the answer, they're going to talk in general, as if like the guy's body count, that don't matter, don't matter here at all, right, and they're going to talk about body count of other women, which, again, it's irrelevant because what we're really talking about is their own body count. So once again, three. If they're faithful to me now, then, I mean, I actually have never asked someone their body count, so. There you go. What did I just say? <laughs> it doesn't matter, right? We're not talking about whoever you are dating. We're talking about you, in this case, this girl, right? I guess I don't really want to know. Like, why would you want to know? It's just going to make you upset. Like, There you go. See, she gave you two different takes all in one. She's talking about the other guy, right? Whoever she's dating. And then she's talking about herself, which is what women do all the time, right? Which is what confuses all the guys all the damn time. It's this double thinking, which is why I always say once again, they are two, right? And I know it's a hard concept to understand, right? But um, I'm breaking it down for you, right? I've been saying it for a while now. I hope it's starting to now make sense. But if it's crazy, like in the hundreds, then yeah, I'm going to be like, hmm, but... Yeah, I don't... Like, what's the difference? A hundred, one, right? Quick mathematical equation for you out there in TV land. Check this out. And that is why we say think outside the box. 
Another perfect example for the space luchador to teach you a thing or two right now. Check it out. Let's say the body counts 100. Right now, oh, well, now you're like, well, it's 100. Oh, shit. What if the body counts 1? However, this 1 times that by 100. What is the difference? <laughs> so I leave you homework right there. Right, it's probably worse. Um, the one times one hundred is worse. Trust me. Right, let's continue. I don't really ask. I don't know. I'm so mixed about it. I used to be such a prude, and I and, and body count was like, I don't, it really did matter to me. And then the more I thought about it, I kind of thought about like, oh, shaking someone's hand, and it's like, oh, does it really? <laughs> it's very different but in a way like it's just sort of an activity so i don't know really how much it matters i think what matters more is that you're being safe and it's more of an activity this ain't no damn activity I'm talking about this is the be all end all of the relationship <laughs> more of an activity whatever where did you go right <laughs> um Maybe I should make this into a couple parts because, you know, I'm only doing these uh, long ass videos and I don't know, right, if you're going, right, my viewers, I mean, if you want to go through like a long ass 40, 45 minute video or would you rather, you know, take one at a time, right, kind of like pills, right, <laughs> a dosage, right, take one a day, right, yeah, let, let's do that, let's do that. We're going to do uh, part one. Maybe I'm going to do part three. Oh, technical difficulties. Um, yeah, so. Well, let's do a couple more. And then uh, the PB, that will conclude part one of this video. And then we'll do like part two and part three. Now. All right, I can't believe I'm like planning other videos within my video, but there you go. It's raw as it's gonna get. Right? This ain't no uh, takes or editing, like I said. Right? I don't like editing. Um, but let's continue. If you're if you're being loyal, I think those are way more important than your past. You heard that at the end. If you're being loyal, uh, no, that's not what we're talking about, honey. You don't count. Irrelevant. I feel like nobody ever tells their true body count anyway, so why? Of course not, because <laughs> because it could go either way, right? If your body count is shitty, then you suck. If your body count is high, then you're a slut. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> that rhymed. <laughs> I should put that on a shirt. Um, But anyways, once again, man's point of view understand that we're talking about women right it's different for men but <laughs> um there you go let's see i even ask but if it's above a certain number oh yeah um i do want to say this for men out there right understand this the fact that you ask is detriment to you right if you feel that you need to know it Find out. Do recon. Never, ever ask. There's a way, right? Um, <laughs> but, you know, again, it takes work and stuff. And I, I don't really recommend um, you going down that path anyways, right? Because I'll show you a trick later on on how to get over all that, right? But for now, um, we're doing... The simple stuff, right? We're starting at level one. So let's continue. I would say I can I can see commitment issues rooting from the the desire and the need to not settle and not She knows. Settle for one person in bed. So that can lead to commitment issues and other relationship issues. Should men I've learned some things over the years. Huh. I learned I can't get rid of these fucking commercials. <laughs> That's what I learned. 
Oh, man. Well, there you go. Roz is going to get once again. Oh. Of course. I ain't going to let you skip it. All right, here we go. That was one of the No, because they're allowed to have 100 bodies and we're not. Oh, yeah, check this out. This is why I say, all right, again, I always say, pay attention. Pay attention and understand it's all psychology, all right? It's all the matrix. It's all the system. They're all the same, right? Remember that one that answered no. She was pissed about it. What you, well, long and behold, what do we have here? See this stance right here of crossing her hands? It's the same stance. Now, this is what I call, you know, in the Matrix, like the cat, <laughs> right? Um, When the cat did the, you know, deja vu and all that shit. Well, there you go. Here it is. You can use deja vu to your advantage, right? Because deja vu is there for a reason, right? It's basically so you can catch the pattern, right? So there you go. I don't really get into that. But look. Same thing, same attitude, same answer, same little position. So, if you're going to take anything from that, from the space luchador, is they're all the same. Now, I'm not saying the woman is the same, but they all act the same. Difference, okay? Before anybody gets butt hurt, right? Well, what are you trying to... Uh, yeah, <laughs> I am. <laughs> uh, let's continue. Okay. Not that I do, but I'm just saying. Yeah. You know. No. <laughs> I personally don't think so. Um, no, I guess if a guy is gonna care about her body count, then right. yeah, she can care about his. But. No, no, no. Once again, there you go. It's always it's always a little mixture of the same answer, right? Of the, well, if he can do it, I can do it too. Right, which is, which is just a big ass like, you know, veil, in men's eyes, right, to make you think a certain kind of way, and that is that you're the same, right, or maybe less, <laughs> right, and it's working, if we judge by twenty twenty two, standards, right. So let's continue. I feel like. There's definitely a double standard, as we all know. Yeah. And if a guy is saying something like, oh, that girl is such a sludge, such a blah, 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 then immediately they're unattractive to me. Like, why are you talking about that? Why do you care? Everyone. Spoiler alert. He cares because that's supposed to be his woman. Now, if that wasn't his woman, then he can give a rat's ass. But... There you go once again, how they don't understand, but they actually do. They do understand, but they ain't going to tell you. What they do is this. You saw that? That's about angles, right? It's all about the angle. If you can't see this because you don't have the man's point of view, then you see this. Eh, don't mean it's not a two. It's just that you're seeing it the wrong way. Right, once, and we'll end with that because I like that, right? <laughs> My little angle example there. And um, yeah, part one for today. Good enough. So let's go back to the quote. Um, where is it? Okay, here we go. Beware of those who claim to have no interest in power, right? Where, oh, shit. Yeah. Is often a strategy to disarm you. When the time comes, they will strike without hesitation. And it will be too late to act. Although, like I always say, it's backwards. Right? Understand. If you're in a situation, it's already too late to act. <laughs> right? So, you read it backwards, right? Because it ends with too late to act. So, read it backwards, it's too late to act already. So, you're kind of screwed there, right? Now, this is where you got to understand who's the one trying to take the power from you. 
right? It's the woman, right? And claims, right? She claims, like you saw, they all claim that it shouldn't matter or that personally it doesn't matter or that if you're judging, it doesn't matter. It's again to take the power from you, right? It's a strategy, once again. So there you go, I broke down the uh, quote for you. And um, yeah, you see how simple it really is once you break it down, right? And why is it important? Now, if you agree with me, give me a like, right? If you disagree or have anything you wanna add, or maybe there's something that was a little bit confusing, or maybe you want to give me your little righteous um, version of why it doesn't matter. You could put it down there in the comments down below. I will answer. I'm not. I'm not a bully, so I won't be attacking you or anything like that. I will answer though, right? Because there's nothing wrong with being civil, right? <laughs> and debating, right? We can argue this, right? But understand, right? That there's a difference between me arguing with another guy and me arguing with a woman. Big difference. Right? As you can see on the screen, one, two, three. Mathematics. So there you go. <laughs> I'll end with that one. Uh, share. And um, yeah, this is part ends part one of this taboo question. I'll do part two later, and I'll upload it later as well. And um, yeah, look forward to that. And uh, let's continue to grow. So thank you to my new subscribers. Um, I do have bigger and better things for you. I got a lot. A lot. It's just so much to impact, right? And I think they're really, really important, right? Big-ass points, big-ass things um, of importance. They make all the difference. That's like trying to build a damn skyscraper, right? And trying to skip by uh, getting cheap-ass material. You know what happens? Yeah, you might be able to build the damn thing, but at the end of the day, it's going to all fall apart. So why do all that damn work for you to fail in the end um, anyway? So I'm trying to avoid that for you because we can make a difference and change right where we're going. We're already in a basket. Now we're headed for hell, right? I want to change that. So there you go. Space with y'all on this one. I'll see you on the next one.